anyways the mm. internal problems outweigh my problems you, <laughs> mm. <laughs> that work mm-hmm. and so my contract is not renewed mm-hmm. and mm-hmm. i have to leave mm-hmm. but it's interesting how of course like any person working in any organization you write mm. your exit email mm. and i got three job offers oh wow i'm like oh but it was based on the goodwill mm. and the prominence of this work that mm. people felt wow mm. you can help us with devolution mm. and based on how exhausted i was mm. based on just this really bad relationship i had with my uh, supervisor mm. i didn't feel like i had the capacity to honestly work and deliver mm. it was i i was exhausted mm-hmm. and so i decided i'll take a break mm. and out of the three mm-hmm. one of the ladies uh, that offered me said i don't even want you to come and work in the office i mm-hmm. want to hire you as a consultant mm. and give me a six month equivalent mm. of work mm-hmm. so i was an idol mm. and remember i told you i was married no children mm-hmm. as soon as i left in february mm-hmm. and in march i was pregnant mm. so it does perhaps explain mm. the pressure mm. the the correlation between my work pressure mm. and just everything that was mm. going on mm. so my first trimester was oh it was hard mm. yeah i was one of those that cannot keep anything down mm. so which office am i going to work mm. on mm. who am i going to work for mm. that is going to give me this me and then i'm trying to figure out a pregnancy mm. So I decided I'll be a consultant mm. and I just sat down one evening and mm. wrote my pro- my my strategic plan for the consultancy. Yes, and mm-hmm. that's how long you started. Mm. I registered a business mm. name. What was uh, the name of the business? Longview. Long I wanted view. I wanted uh, something around with a name futures. Mm-hmm. I couldn't get mm-hmm. for site for development I couldn't mm-hmm. get so mm-hmm. eventually. Mm went for long view because it still communicates that futuristic it is a bit and by this mm. time mm. the thing i know how to do best is research mm. policy analysis and mm. future within the context of so futures. that that futuring became mm. the it mm. even if i'm offering mm. uh, research mm. policy analysis mm. and mm. strategy mm. so i started and it worked the pieces come together so, so this six month well. contract yeah. it was my yeah. first job yeah what was it on different things devolution all right editing yeah ah uh, yeah. ah okay so it was a good contract with it was that that and i'm working from home a lot of and what, i'm imagine getting paid yeah an equivalent of what i earned yeah in an office. really nice that really was nice. that was confirmation yeah 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 so i was very grateful that's yeah. how i started yeah. out of necessity yeah and oh fantastic yeah and then many other people yeah in the sector yeah. again social capital yeah. gave me work mm, mm. i'm telling you i worked i worked i worked as if i was in an office mm. different projects different clients mm. there was goodwill mm. from the people that mm. had worked with me mm. or had heard of yes. my work mm. in ie and si mm, mm, they mm. gave me work mm. yeah mm. you didn't go necessarily applying nope. for a lot of these things nope. The, when people just had it was had... recently that i started applying for mm, work mm. for the first so 2014 mm-hmm. uh, so now we're in 2022 mm-hmm. i can say actually up to last year i don't think i ever did any work that i applied for mm. oh wow All that's those, uh, one reference point to another yeah like eight, mm. eight or so years of of Mm-hmm. work that just comes and, and just comes and, and just comes and its references yeah that was that that has been powerful that very powerful again because and then the other thing about development work yeah is that by the time you know consul- we can say on paper what we can do mm-hmm. but there has to be a trust element mm. and and i realize this interpersonal relationships is what gives you trust mm. and people don't really go out saying uh, this work is poor they they just assess and mm. they say honestly this piece is incredible we know good. the person yeah. that can do and because also futures is getting traction yes so people are like she's the only one we know mm. so based on that then you get a lot mm. of that type mm. of work mm. because there are not many people yeah. doing it at yeah. least formally yeah yeah so you mentioned that um when you're found in this hmm. you're also um pregnant for, yes. with your firstborn yes. um 
you take a break or no uh, no, no 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 time to take a break ah no i'm my father's daughter so <laughs> you do what needs to be done yes. if you've gotten work you follow through yes so i'm um, um, i mean i take breaks when i need to mm, mm. i mean like um and then we moved into a new house mm-hmm. so it's interesting how it was um a fairly new estate mm-hmm. so on the side i was living on mm-hmm. literally the, the the guards would not see me like for three days mm. and they would come and they're like hey Mm. No, we know you're pregnant. We we don't see you a lot. We just mm. needed to know that you're fine. Mm. Yeah, that's how mm. intense my life was, even yeah. at home. Yeah, even like so. This is a house office, so you're there. Yeah, you're it's... digging in completely. Yeah, yeah. But you see, it's, mm. it's it's not manual labor. Mm. It's you just need to have a comfortable yeah, chair, chair. Just make sure your back is fine. Yeah, and then just take yeah. away. Yeah, take yeah. the yeah. breaks. You yeah, need. do your research, yeah. analysis. Actually, an interesting story. Mm-hmm. Now that you mentioned this. Mm. In November, so my I was due mm-hmm. like on November 14th mm-hmm. to supplant CS. Mm. A week before that, mm. or sometime before that, mm. that lady calls me mm-hmm. and she says, "You know, we need to get work on extractives." Mm. I have racked my brain. I don't know anyone else who can help me. I'm like, I've never done anything on extractives. Mm-hmm. Like, you are the best I can think of in mm. research mm-hmm. and policy analysis. Mm. And you see, because you're a researcher, you can pretty do much. Yeah, research. research applies across board. Exactly. Yeah. So she tells me, I I just need you to figure out what in extractives we need to be doing. Mm. And on on, so on Monday, and I think it was a Monday. Mm. I arrive in that meeting looking like a truck because <laughs> I'm due on Friday. Mm. I'm, I'm, like I need to go and give birth on Friday. Mm-hmm. But she says, don't worry, we will take care of you. And, and I said, where is that? Where is Norwegian the Church Aid, but they closed the Kenyan office. Oh, so okay, all right. So that okay. that mm-hmm. was like their grand mm-hmm. pro- exit mm-hmm. project. Mm-hmm. And I'm like, you're taking a risk. And mm-hmm. she said, because I trust you. Mm-hmm. And and th- those words meant so much. Mm-hmm. So I was worried mm-hmm. as, as as a new mom, mm-hmm. I'm wondering, uh, uh, you know, because employers when yeah. they hear that a woman is gonna give birth, yeah, they they just they want to distance. They won't pick you mm-hmm. because they need somebody who's more available. Yeah. And so I asked this lady, and she's like. Uh, we don't worry. Mm. You will. We, we trust you. Mm. you we we'll just give you the that's, leeway. That speaks volumes. That that to me mm. again. It's. It, I guess it's. It, this speaks to now women in development. Yeah. For another woman to trust me, I think that that to me I couldn't let that mm. fail. Mm. And she's trusting me on a subject I've never done before. Mm. So what I did is I didn't try and give myself the pressure of being an expert. Mm. So I did what I do best, mm. collective intelligence. Mm. We called a few people, a few people, mm. she facilitated it. Mm-hmm. Uh, she facilitated the meeting, mm-hmm. but I, I came in and mm. did the actual facilitation mm-hmm. of the meeting. Mm. And, and we figured out mm. what is the unique thing in the extractive sector we can do. Mm. So um, then we agreed it was a research on and, and tie this um, extractive work with communities. Mm-hmm which is again this uh, whole thing about uh, finding oil in Shukana, mm. coal in Kitui, mm-hmm. and there wasn't anyone speaking specifically on community relations mm. in this regard. Right. IEA, which is my former now organization at mm-hmm. this point, also mm-hmm. subcontracted me to do scenarios work around extractive. Mm-hmm. So I was building my knowledge mm-hmm. in these areas. Mm-hmm. Around the same time? Uh, I don't know whether it was before or after. Mm. It may have been, no, no, it was mm-hmm. after. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So this is my first one. Mm. And then I get a team of researchers. Mm. I, in a sense, play a supervisory role mm-hmm. for them to deliver on the papers. Mm. I edit the papers, mm. compile a book, mm. and it, we have it published. Mm. And this lady, her name is Wasia Mosion. Mm. I am telling you, never at any one point did she panic. I mean, I'm a new mom, so I don't know what is going to happen mm. with this kid. I, I don't know how I'm going to manage. Mm. But my the first years, like from zero months to 50, to one one year, mm. I was now working on that as a major project. Mm. I had others, mm-hmm. uh, but I couldn't let her fail. Mm. And so we did a fantastic publication. Mm-hmm. Um, and this publication became the, the giveaway gift to all the their grantees mm. as a closed office. Oh, wow. But also... Um, it, it, it was really powerful mm. in terms of speaking to even a few coalitions that were coming together mm. on civil society, mm-hmm. religious groups, mm. and the ministry mm. on how to engage communities right. Right. in in, um, 
in, in, in you know the the extractive sector. Mm. So that's another land park project. Mm. But because again, I we, I, was, I didn't follow through. Mm. I mean, after after we handed over the work, mm. that was it. Mm. So, but I see it being quoted quite mm. a lot. Mm. You know, mm. it was mm. interesting. That's that's very interesting. Yeah. Wow.